Hey, Hustas, y'all ready to cook today for Sunday supper after church? Let's get ready. You know what we're going to make today? We're going to do some uh, beef vegetable soup. So let me show y'all what's going into this pot. Come on in. Come on in with your hood, hood girl. First of all, y'all, uh, if you can be solid just for a moment, we're going to pray for eating good. Uh, Pam, she lost her life on Friday. She had some problems with her heart. So if you could say a quiet prayer for her. Because if y'all looked at eating good, she was so beautiful. Had a heart of gold. She was giving a lot of stuff away. So just like say a simple prayer. <clears throat> I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just a little choked up. Because that was my friend. Let's just say a quiet prayer right now. I've already been praying. <laughs> Whew. Life is so short, you know. We don't know what day, what time, when God is going to call us home. So live out loud. Now, come on. Let's cook. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to cook, 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 cook. All right, y'all. Let me bring y'all over here. Come on. So I have my stock pot. I'm going to move that out the way. We're going to start with some 80-20 because you want that fat. We're going to also put in some fresh garlic cloves. That is three huge garlic cloves. That is three stalks of celery, one whole bell pepper, and one whole white onion. I will also be adding um, the soup base, Lipton soup mix. I like to put two packets in there as well. I will be adding some baby carrots, but I will ch uh, cut them in half. I will also be cutting up in very small pieces this cabbage. After it gets cut and washed, it will be also added. I will also add a, uh, a can of, of uh, a diced fire roasted tomatoes. And then I will also be adding a can of cut green beans. So we're going to first get this meat browned. And of course, what seasoning? Oh, can y'all see me? <laughs> Come on up here. What seasoning will I be using? Holly seasoned, of course. I'll be using Holly Seasoned. I may add, well, because there's no salt, I'm definitely going to add some salt, y'all. A little salt. Don't forget it is no salt. Make sure you do add salt when you are using Holly Seasoned. And um, I may add a little extra garlic powder, but we'll, we shall see because we're going to taste as we go along, y'all. So don't forget, Holly Seasoned. They're working on my website right now. It's going to launch after my website is, is, is live. So y'all, keep your eye on the prize because it's surely coming, honey. Yeah, so this is what we're going to use, y'all. So once I get this uh, this uh, hamburger meat in the pot, oh, let me keep that there. Hey, once I, once I put the uh, brown, the, um, oh, y'all, I lost my train of thought. I got so much on my mind. Brown my ground beef, that is, I'll, and, and get it drained, and then we'll start adding the other stuff. Um I'll be back. Oh, y'all, one thing I forgot, beef bouillon. Beef, add, I got the powder. Make sure you add some beef bouillon powder as well. Maybe because <sighs> with the soup, I, I would say I have a cup of beef bouillon powder, but if you're going to add a little at a time, because sometimes, you, you know, it can be a little salty, so be careful. I'm going to be adding some beef bouillon powder. So I'll be back. Cheers. Hey, Hoosters. Now my ground beef is browned. Oh, I wish y'all could see in this pot. We got it all good and browned. So what we're going to do now, 
we're going to add in like four cups of hot water and I probably should have had that before I got back on camera but that's okay Matter of fact, let me get it and come on back. Okay, y'all, we're gonna add in about four cups of hot water. Cause you're making soup, so let's make it six to eight cups. Okay, y'all, so I've added eight cups of hot water, and then I'm going to add in what I told you, like a, a half, a half, a, a half a cup of, uh-oh, a half a cup of uh, beef bouillon. Because this is beef soup, yeah. So about a, a half a cup. Oh, you can follow the directions on the back to how to make beef broth. But you know when you, you know, African American people, we don't measure. <laughs> we we don't measure. We don't measure at all. Give that a stir. You're going to add in both packs of Lipton onion soup mix. You can even try the beef. I've never tried the beef soup mix. I've only used this one. So you use what you like, but I like the Lipton onion better in my beef soup. We're going to also go ahead and add in all of our dry vegetables that I presented at the beginning. Boy, these are bendable cutting boards. Show sure come in handy, y'all. We've added that in. I'm gonna let this. Uh, I'm gonna let this cook down for about uh, ooh, 25 minutes, maybe, and then I'll come back in. And uh, uh, well, I'm gonna go ahead and add the carrots, of course, and then I'm gonna come back in because by then I'll have the the cap, the half of that cabbage uh, chopped up to go in here, and I'll have those green beans washed and drained and ready to go in here as well, as well as the fire roasted. Uh, tomatoes y'all. I'll be back. Stay tuned. All right, Hoosters. Now I'm going to add in my Holly seasoning to that blend. Don't forget, you're going to taste as you go uh, as well. You're going to add that in your beef soup. Look at that, y'all. So I'm going to give that a stir. I'm going to also taste it to make sure that um, I got my tasting spoon, y'all. Not 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 this big one. And make sure that if I have to add some more, because holly season is holly seasoned, y'all. <laughs> really is holly seasoned. Look at look at that broth in there. Look at that. Let's see. Oh, damn, that's good. That is good. Y'all, that's good. So we're going to let this simmer for about 25 minutes, y'all. Then I'll come back and add the other things that we said. Bye. Y'all, I forgot. Somebody went to their Florida uh, home and brought back some uh, lemon. I forgot to tell you, I like to squeeze fresh lemon in my beef soup. So come on, y'all. Let's get that. Ooh, look at all that juice, y'all. Now, that's a, that's a lemon. Look at all of it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. That is going to be good. So, do not buy that stove of that stove. That store brought lemon. I know y'all say some of it in the package is real. I don't know about that. You got to use real lemon juice. See you in a moment. Okay, Hustas, I'm back. 
let me let y'all see how it look in that pot. So what we're going to do now is we're going to add in our fire roasted tomatoes in the juice. I also I also have one fresh tomato left. You know when you just have one fresh tomato, go ahead and put it in there. I wasn't gonna use it in nothing. And then I've already uh, rinsed off my green beans. I'm gonna go ahead and throw them in there as well. And then in the sink over here, I have already washed my cabbage greens and I will add them gradually because as you see, that pot is uh, getting full. So y'all know cabbage shrinks. So we're gonna get that in there. And then after you add all this, go ahead and taste your um, and taste your um, your juice because you still want that full beef flavor, and you're gonna add accordingly to your taste buds. Because after all, holiday season will tantalize your taste bud. Let me wash my hands, y'all. And I like vegetables, y'all. Y'all see how much cabbage I... But it was just one small head of cabbage anyway. So go ahead and press that down. I'm going to also bring this to a boil. And then we're just going to let... Because I still want to like a little crunch in my cabbage, y'all. So I'm going to let this cook for maybe another... Um, oh, oh. I say 10 to 15 minutes. Just... Uh, for that cabbage to get to how I like it. Y'all, that's going to be some good soup. Y'all see all them uh, carrots and look at that, y'all. Ooh, honey, let me bring y'all over here. Y'all need to close up on here. Look at that. That's going to be some good beef soup, y'all. So, fall back for about... 10 to 15 minutes and then we will taste it together but i am i'm, I'm, I'm going to get another taste matter of fact i'm gonna do it while y'all on here i'm gonna get another tasting spoon and we're gonna go ahead and taste it just in case we need to add some more a holly seasoned damn that's good oh baby Baby, that is so full of flavor, honey. Who, honey? We definitely will come back. See you in a moment, though. Hey, hostars, we back. Well, can y'all see in this bowl? Y'all can't see in this bowl, but you can see it out here. Baby, I already took my neighbor some, and she's loving it. This bowl is really hot, y'all. That bowl is hot, hot, hot. I always feed my neighbors. Remember I told y'all? I'm going to pull y'all back. Let's taste it, y'all. That's hot. Mm. Mm. It is so full of flavor. That's going to be really hot. We're going to put that down. And, that, you know, the fire roasted... Tomatoes give it a great flavor to y'all. This is something, something delicious. I think I'm going to add a little hot sauce. I dab, I do it. Oh, it's hot. Mmm, mmm, it's hot. Mm. Damn, it feels so good. Going down on this cold day here in Texas. It's cold, y'all. Mm. I sure wish I can send y'all a bowl. But thank y'all for joining me. Love you.
Bye, Hustlers.